Kenji from Serious Eats. I'm here with Aaron Zimmer and Hamon in the car, and we're driving up to New Haven, Connecticut area right now to taste four of the country's greatest pizzas side by side. Uh, that would be Zupardi's, Pepe's, Modern, and Sally's. And, uh, you know, hopefully we'll see which one is the best. Set as destination. Setting new destination. This is the place. Here we are. So we're here, um, we're here at Zupardi's in West Haven, and we just ordered a clam pizza, and Zupardi's is the only place I know of world maybe that actually shucks their clams to order for their pizzas. If you wanted to, you could you could just shuck them, eat them raw, shoot them. I'll just add a little bit of parsley to the bowl. And when it goes on the pie, just a little bit of garlic, olive oil, oregano, and a little bit of crushed red pepper. You know, it, start, it starts with a really good base of bread, and then when they put the clams on top, you end up with a really crisp crust on the bottom, and then a layer of kind of chewy bread on top of that, and soft layer at the very top. And a lot of those juices come out when they slice it, so they won't slice it until you're ready to eat it. Right. You can call ahead and order a pizza, but they refuse to slice it till, until you actually eat it because you don't want those juices to fall underneath and disappear. When I was a kid, we used to go to Pepe's, and then eventually when word about that place started spreading too far and it was crowded all the time, we started coming here instead. This is like the perfect pizza as I remember it as a kid. So Ed says in his book that they really like cheese at Modern, so it's going to be a cheesy one. At Modern, they use an oil-fired oven that they get up to like 850 or 900 degrees, which is not you know, oil-fired ovens are not normal. But what I really like about them is that all the cornmeal from the previous pies sits on the bottom of that oven, turns black, and then the pizza the pizza picks that up. When As soon as they put the crust in there, it picks up that burnt cornmeal, and that's what gives it that really good, complex, deep, charred, smoky flavor. Still tastes pretty good to me. I mean, Ed's right in that the, the dough at the parties, the actual bread part is better. So Ed was right about the cheese. Add this to the leftovers collection. It's just a puddle of wrinkles right now. Among pizza cognizanti, the whispers were getting louder. Pepe's is going downhill fast, said my brother's friend Alan. This is my dad's favorite pizza place growing up, and hence it's probably my favorite pizza place. Although I haven't been back here in years, so I couldn't tell you how the pizza is now. But it looks pretty good. We're at Pepe's, we didn't have to wait. We this, walked right up to table 24. This is a true coal oven pizza place, so they got big coal oven, gets up to probably eight and 900 degrees. Pies cook pretty fast, they come up pretty charred. They cut everything in kind of a ha haphazard way, so you get like really tiny slices around the edge. Once you get to the center, like some, they crisscross their lines, so you end up with pieces with their fronts missing, or like tiny little triangles that you can pick out with your fingers. And the sausage is definitely different from modern. And it's cut different. This one's sliced. Modern does chunks. Zupardi's does their own sausage in chunks. It's somewhere in between Zupardi's and modern. It's not as thin as modern. It's still kind of bready, but it's obviously not as thick as Zupardi's, and it's got that really good char. Pepe's is pretty well known for its clam pie, but it doesn't compare to Zupardi's. They use pre-shucked clams, a lot of oregano. Like rubbery, not Juicy and briny. People say Pepe's is going downhill, but I think they're not. But is it as good as you remember it being? As a little Kenji? It's not. I mean, nothing will ever be as good as I remember it being, but it's pretty damn good. We're here for the Sally's. It's Ed Levine's favorite pizza place in the area. We came all the way here with a book. Ed signed it for Flo. Everything's ending with tragedy. It's closed. So we might just stand outside and leave. Right. There'll be more pizza. Release the dog.